Ever wonder where the water goes after you flush the toilet, brush your teeth, it rains or you take a shower? It just goes down the drain, right? Not exactly. This video will give you a glimpse into the wastewater treatment system for the city of Columbus and better help you appreciate the dedicated employees that make sure the wastewater is cleaned and put back into the environment 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. So my name is Brandon Fox. I'm the Jackson Pike Wastewater Treatment Plant Manager. My role here is to ensure that we're meeting the permit compliance for Ohio EPA, uh, making sure that the water that we're treating that comes in goes out and uh, makes the Scioto River cleaner. After you flush the wastewater and everything else that's in it, it goes into underground pipes that collect and transport the dirty water from homes, businesses, and storm drains to one of the city's two wastewater treatment plants. Jackson Pike Wastewater Treatment Plant processes most of the flow from the west side of the city. Raw sewage comes in the plant, and we screen it, remove any of the particulates, any of the heavy leaves, trash, stuff that shouldn't be in the wastewater. From that point, the raw sewage pumps raise it up about 35 feet so that it can flow by gravity through the rest of the plant. So we have primary clarification where we remove the organic solids from the sewage that will settle. That material gets sent to our digesters where we digest the sludge. From primary clarification, it goes into our aeration system. Raw wastewater comes in, uh, mixes with the uh, return activated sludge, and the biology actually removes the nutrients and the organics that are in the wastewater. From aeration, water goes into a final clarifiers. Final clarifiers provide a, a quiescent area for the, uh, the mixed liquor to settle out. Uh, solids settle to the bottom of the clarifiers. Clear water rises to the top. And the clean water goes out to the outfall, to the Scioto River. On average, Jackson Pike treats 85 million gallons of wastewater per day and discharges clean water back into the Scioto River. It has a design capacity of 68 million gallons per day with a peak treatment capacity of approximately 150 million gallons per day. Here we are at the Ores Tunnel. Uh, this is basically a 200 foot deep a uh, four and a half mile long tunnel that starts here at Jackson Pike and ends at basically Nationwide Arena. Designed to capture and eliminate combined sewer overflows through downtown Columbus during wet weather. If this tunnel fills up, it'll, it'll be able to be pumped into the wastewater treatment plant for further treatment. The facility is staffed with 100 skilled professionals that control the operation and maintenance of the plant. I'm a supervisor too in operations. And I work in the lab here at the plant. I really love this job and I want to stay here for a very long time. I'm Roger L. Smith. I worked here 46 years almost, just shy a couple of months. Came here in 72 after I got back from Vietnam. There are operators, mechanics, laboratory chemists, and numerous other skilled employees that ensure wastewater is treated throughout the entire year. A lot of the equipment that's in the plant is original to 1935, or you know, in the 50s and, and when construction has happened. So uh, we can't just go to Lowe's and buy those parts that we need to repair those, those pieces of equipment. We have a little over 8,000 different parts on the shelf to maintain all the equipment. We have very skilled maintenance staff here that, that has to fabricate and make parts occasionally. We repair and maintain equipment that's been in service since 1935. Uh, we process flow 24-7, 365, never stops. So we have to ensure that we have equipment that's in service and, and redundant equipment so that we can continue to process that flow. So the next time it rains or you flush your toilet, remember, there are city employees on the other end of the pipe that ensure the contaminants are removed and clean water is recycled back to the environment.